Prime Minister, welcome. Uh, we have just had a wide-ranging, uh, significant dialogue. Uh, we talked about a lot of areas of interest. Um, two areas that I think um, really will have a profound effect on our respective countries as well as on the world are the issue of climate change and trade. Um, let me start with trade. The Prime Minister uh, is uh, very interested in the Doha round. He's interested in uh, U.S. strategies to achieve success in the Doha round. I assured him that we're committed uh, to achieving a world that trades more freely, that we recognize we have obligations to do um, to deal with our agricultural subsidies in order to move the Doha round forward. Uh, secondly, we talked about uh, uh, climate change, the Prime Minister's concern about greenhouse gases. Uh, I share your concerns about this issue. Uh, we talked about how, on the one hand, we can work together, as I understand we're signing some agreements that have uh, that move forward alternative energy proposals. I assured the Prime Minister that here at home that I'm concerned about the environmental issues as well as the national security implications for being too dependent on oil. I shared with him my optimism about uh, reducing U.S. Uh, gasoline consumption by 20 percent over the next 10 years by promoting alternative fuels. I uh, talked to him about our desire to work with uh, Europe and China and India and Japan and Australia and other countries about an international framework that will meet the following objectives. One, economic vitality and growth. Two, the advance of new technologies. And third, obviously, the effects that will have on reducing greenhouse gases. The Prime Minister made this a center point of our conversation, and I fully appreciate and understand why. I appreciate the leadership you've taken on this important issue, not only in your country, but in, uh, at the EU as well. It's noticeable to me here in the United States, and I, I congratulate you for being a strong leader that you are. All in all, we've had a wonderful discussion, and I welcome you here to the Oval Office. Thank you very much. It's been great. Thank you. Well, I should also say that uh, I've pointed out the importance of uh, President Bush's leadership on the Doha round. Um, there are too few in the world fighting for free trade, so we need the president in that. And I uh, hoped that we could, uh, during a very short span, bring this to an end. And uh, I was so grateful for, for the comments of leadership on, on the, the climate issue that will be debated many years to come. So thank you very much for this. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. you coming. Thank you all.